Good morning, everyone. My name is Chloe Yasmin, and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my new summer wardrobe that I have over here. I actually literally went to this new store called Garage. I ain't gonna hold y'all if Garage is watching it. I wouldn't mind if y'all wanted to sponsor me. But girl, I'm the type of person that I will stay in my own little city. I don't venture off. I don't do nothing because honestly, my mom was never really like a highway driver. My dad was a highway driver, and he passed away, and then they got divorced when I was like younger. So like, all highway driving got cut out at a certain age, and so we never really went other places except for like when my mom and my dad were together so now that I've been driving for a little while I have my own car and everything lately I've been driving places to go get different clothing because where I live it's so wet there's this new store called garage that I'm literally obsessed with I I love it so much. I go in there, every single time I go in there, I can't just walk out with an item or two, maybe even 10 items. I have to walk out with like 30, 40, 50, because yesterday I went and bought 18 outfits plus other stuff. I've also been trying to change my style a little bit. I'm not really sure if you guys have noticed, but my style has changed over the years. I guess I can't say like I'm like trying to, but it just kind of happens with me, you know? I just kind of like go about life. Like I don't try to like stick to one thing. I go through waves, not like an unstable type of wave thing, but y'all know what I mean. It is morning time, so your girl is looking a little bit crazy i got my little spot treatment on because your girl just woke up but i'm super excited to go ahead and share this share this stuff with you guys due to the fourth of july taking place i did want to go ahead and not upload on the fourth of july timing and weekend because i know that a lot of you guys are going to be busy so why drop a video if my girls is about to be busy like that's like making plans without you guys i'm just joking <laughs> Anyway, here are my 18 outfits. I had to wear this Newport hoodie that I bought from them yesterday. I'll be right back. It's really basic. I thought it said New York on it, and when I got home, it said Newport, and I was like, cigarettes? But no, I just bought like this little simple hoodie. It's really cute. It's cute. It's, you know, it's nice, but it's nothing special. It's nothing special. It's just an all-white hoodie. But this is where I will be modeling all of the clothing. I just found that this corner right here is just so perfect to do the modeling at. Like, not really modeling. Girl, I ain't no model. Girl, I'll be stiff like this. <laughs> They be like, she pretty, get her off the stage, she can't move, she ain't got no type of rhythm. But I'm not gonna hold you guys any longer, I'm gonna go ahead and take the first outfit off of the shelf. This one's actually really cute, really basic, but definitely very cute. This is like the hot cami they have, it's a lace trim cami, and it's super cute, I love it. I was just praying and hoping that it wouldn't be too cropped, and it's honestly perfect. And then I just have these brown street wide leg pants that are honestly adorable. These two fit my body so well, I have to show you guys. I believe this is meant to be like a crop top. I'm not the biggest fan of crop tops I have noticed that with a lot of shirts nowadays they make most majority of shirts especially in the summertime cropped so I kind of have to work around how they design them this is cropped but these are mostly high-waisted so it kind of evens it out sometimes it doesn't even out so I kind of have to accept that like a little bit of belly will show okay you guys so this right here is the outfit I do kind of feel like maybe this would be a little bit cuter if this was like a darker color like the lace trimming but it's still so cute if you guys could only see that this is not like a gray it's like a really like light brown in person i know you guys can't really see that but the pants honestly fit so well with the shirt i'm not really sure if the mirror is going to give you guys like a better angle or like a better view but this is definitely a super cute outfit i'm super excited to go ahead and rock it gotta find the right shoes gotta find the right like hair like everything has to kind of like play into it so i have to have my hair done i have to have like the right nails the right jewelry the right shoes get it all together it'll come together very nicely okay so this very next outfit is honestly super cute so i have the san antonio shirt which is honestly super cute it's supposed to be cropped but these pants are pretty high-waisted the thing that i love about garage i genuinely was gonna buy like just all pants because their pants are like my dream pants i have always wanted super loose cute cargo-ish type of pants and they do that for me they have the cutest pants you guys have to see them on one of the best pieces out of this whole entire wardrobe i literally love these pants y'all these pants oh my gosh she's like my favorite pants right now i'm so obsessed right now these colors go together so well like this this black but it's like a um, washed up black a little bit with like the san antonio blah 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 super cute but these cargo pants girl these are fire i can never find good cargo pants that'll actually fit my waist these literally fit my waist i'm like what the heck's happened these are in a size extra small i just love cargo pants because i love the loose look i love that if i'm walking you can't really see anything um as opposed to if i were wearing something tighter they're super comfortable they just look amazing and if you're really skinny and if you're like which i'm not promoting being insecure about skinny but if you are insecure about being skinny looser clothing always just makes you feel so much better and that's just me all day okay i haven't said this yet but if you came here for some real bougie, Louis Vuitton, Fendi clothing, girl, it ain't, you ain't gonna find it here, baby, because cause, uh, uh, this is my Fendi and my Gucci, because this is expensive to me. $20 for a shirt? 
and that's it to me. This next outfit here, I'm not really sure if you guys remember, but I bought these shorts in a recent vlog. I actually bought a bunch of clothes from Garage recently, like $800 worth, and I hauled it all. So if you guys wanna watch that, I have a vlog linked down below, and I hauled all my new Garage clothes, but I got these from H&M. Super cute, right? Well, I went to Garage and found a bandeau, a cute orange bandeau in that video, remember? Super cute, I was like, okay, it's gonna be a really cute beach outfit. But then I went on the Garage website and seen they had this. So I went into the store and bought this in a medium because the other ones were so cropped. So I have not tried this on yet, so I'm not really sure how it's gonna look. And it just says Malibu on it. I make time for what I want. Girl, look how cute this is. This is like a super cute, like basic beach carnival type of outfit when it's extremely hot and you don't wanna wear a bunch of clothing. This is definitely it. It's a very like airy top. Wait, that doesn't even make sense. I've just been making up my own words, but it's like a airy, wait. It's like a, like you're gonna get air through this top. You know, it's really thin, it's nothing crazy. They look so cute together, I literally love them. I don't have to wear that bandeau anymore unless I am honestly for real going to a beach. Cause this right here, I don't have to wear to a beach cause it's not too cropped. It actually is so perfect. Oh my gosh, I love it. And I paired these up really good. This is from H&M. I bought these at H&M in the men's section in a size extra small. So if you feel like you're like my size, then yeah. Now this outfit right here was a little out of my my comfort zone for real now I'm half white so I can say that definitely a white girl outfit but it's really cute it's really basic but it's really cute and I'm gonna wear it with my white vans this right here I was just gonna buy as a bra but when I got in the house and I put these jeans on with it what do they call these I believe these are called crop tops so I think these are actually cami soft seamless basic cami and then these pants I think I already bought these pants before but these are the jambe large wide legs goes really cute together I thought it was gonna be too cropped until I put them on together let me just go ahead and try it on so you guys can see what I'm talking about okay, okay. So I hope that you guys kind of see what I'm talking about with this outfit. I put on the white vans because I thought it would go honestly kind of perfect with it. You guys can't really see like the full outfit though. But I have on my white vans just to let you guys know. I do kind of feel like with this top, there is just a little bit too much cleavage. Um, it's not too bad. Um, I feel like it's definitely still a cute outfit. But yeah, this is the outfit. Super basic. I'm going to show you guys in the mirror. Okay, so y'all ain't gonna believe this one. I found the shorts that I've literally been looking for for years. So I have like this basic gray t-shirt, really basic. Y'all know I like my basic gray t-shirts. This one is a little bit different than my normal ones because it does kind of come up on the neck a little bit more. Now these shorts make the whole entire outfit. This is the kind of outfit that you can wear some dope shoes with. Look at these shorts, you have to see them on, but I love shorts like this because they're not like booty shorts. Okay, so these are the shorts, super cute, right? Super basic t-shirt. I guess it's, this is not even worth a haul. It's just a regular basic t-shirt. These are super cute though, I really like them. I never really go for like super light colored jeans or shorts. So I do have like a darker pair of these, but they look way better. These are honestly adorable. I love the rips, I love how they look. I think my biggest thing is that they come so much past my butt that it just makes me feel so much more comfortable because like back in the day when I used to wear shorter shorts, they used to always ride up and we already know what happens after that, so yeah. I ain't even on TikTok in a minute for real. Okay, so these shorts are gonna go with the swimsuit that I wanna wear. So I bought this swimsuit and I always wear swim trunks over it. Um, or if I'm not going to be swimming, I'll just wear like jean shorts or whatever I wanna wear like over them. So I bought this swimsuit. Oh my gosh, literally adorable. I had to try this on for you guys, but I'm gonna wear it with these jean shorts. Here are another pair of 90s jean shorts, but I'm also gonna wear it with this honey t-shirt and it has cherries on it so that says honey super cute right super cute and then i'm gonna go ahead and pair them up with my 90s shorts that are literally adorable so these shorts are gonna go with that shirt and then also my swimsuit they're all so cute together so let's go ahead and put them on okay so this outfit is not really my style <clears throat> But I like it. I'm not gonna hold you guys up. It's really, this is what I really consider like super like basic. Um, it's definitely cute. I just don't usually wear stuff like this. So it's definitely different and I'm coming out of my comfort zone. I think I really like it. Um, I'm just gonna pair these up with like my white vans. So yeah. But yeah, this is the outfit. Super cute, super cute. I just love how like, with summer clothing, it just goes so well with a tan. Okay, so this is the swimsuit. I could totally wear it with the shorts kind of like this. I'm not really sure if you guys used to do that, but back in the day, when me and my friends got done swimming or whatever, we kind of like left our shorts like this. We was bad little kids, I ain't gonna hold y'all. But then I could also have them zipped up and cute like that as well, so that's super cute. But then I would just go ahead and show you guys this cute little swimsuit. I think it's really cute. I love the color. I don't think I would've bought this if it wasn't for this gold chain type of thing going on. Super cute, I love gold. Gold just goes with my skin so well. 
well. I just love gold. Like, I'm a very big fan of gold. That's all I wear is gold. So, yeah, very cute swimsuit, very cute outfit. Love these shorts. Super classy, super cute. And the next time that I go swimming or the next time that I'm going to a beach, I don't always be swimming. I'm going to tell y'all straight up, I don't swim in lakes. I don't do lakes. I don't like lakes because it's like nasty water. That's like me putting a bunch of dirt, dead frogs, dead bugs into a bathtub and me just going to soak in it. Like, I just can't. Like, I'm not putting myself up for that risk you know like i used to swim in lakes my whole entire life but i'm just not about that life anymore you know so on to the next outfit okay so this one right here did not come out how i thought it was gonna come out very cute it's like this dress shirt or whatever with this blue dress i thought it was gonna come out totally different i'm gonna show you guys kind of what i'm talking about in a minute but it's very cute dress very cute dress it cinches on the side and then i just kind of like picked up this dress shirt to go over it and it just didn't really plan out how i thought but this would totally go with my all white converses that i have these new converses that they came out with here they are right here they they are so cute. I have not worn them yet. They're like platform converse. Girl, these are fire. Okay, so this is a dress. I really like it. The only thing that I do not like is that it's not really cinching in the stomach part. It makes my stomach look bigger just by like having all this loose stuff. I would rather it be like this. So I am going to try to shrink it and see what I can do, but I definitely should have bought the extra small. I bought the small, but I should have bought the extra small because I feel like the extra small would have fit me better. So I am going to try to shrink it and see if it'll do something about it. I mean, I guess it's not too bad. Actually, it's actually not too bad at all. I think it's kind of cute. I mean, it's not too bad with this. I think it would definitely be like a statement piece. Um, but my hair is also not done right now. But I also was thinking, this is actually really ugly. I'm not even sure why I did it. This is what I used to do back in the day when my stuff was too big. So I used to just do what I had to do. Okay, how do y'all feel about this? I think it's kind of ugly. But I think it could definitely work. I think it's definitely very different. Unless I buttoned it up right here. I feel like maybe if I buttoned it up. But I think I probably would zip it up just to be a little bit different. This is really cute and it would go so cute with those Converse. Yeah, I think I like it buttoned, but it would go so cute with like these Converse. Maybe not actually. Maybe just the Vans or maybe just like some cute little sandals. So that's that outfit. But y'all know I don't ever really wear dresses like that. I actually made the same exact mistake with this outfit. Oh my gosh. I didn't see this in the store. If I would have seen that somebody had makeup on the dress, I wouldn't have bought it. If you feel like you're going to get makeup on something that's white or get anything on the clothing that people are going to buy, I really wouldn't suggest doing it because now you're damaging their merchandise and I just bought it. And I thought that this white t-shirt, this white dress shirt would go with it and it did not. It looks so bad. So I got to figure out what the heck I'm going to wear this dress with, but I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. It's not the same thing as this blue one. Okay, let me show you guys what this junk looks like. Like, girl, what was I, what was I trying to do? What kind of look was I going for? It's not cute at all. You can go like this all you want. You can go like this all you want. You can do what you want. This ain't it. So honestly, I kind of knew it. And then on top of that is foundation on this collar right here. Like there's foundation all right here. I do not like that. I do not like this junk at all. I don't even really ever wear dresses. So this was definitely like an impulse buy, but I do not like this dress. I'm not gonna talk about it no more. Okay, so this next outfit is super cute. I have another one of those lace camis, except for it's in black with the white, with the white lace trim. And then some more like car Cargo type of pants. What do they even call these? I remember them kind of okay. Pantalon, pantalon carpenter pants. I remember like yeah, that being the thing. And these are in the um color grunge gray. It's kind of like a brownish gray. No, it's kind of like a brown gray and black all mixed together. So let's go ahead and try this. Super cute, right? Oh my gosh, literally adorable. I love these pants. They actually fit my waist. What size did I get these? And had to be extra small. Oh, a double zero. Oh okay. Definitely very different, but I definitely love these pants. They're so cute. You guys really have to like see them for real. They have like what do you call this they have like this little strap thingy right here which is super cute i just love this look it's a really cute look it really does fit i have like a pocket back here this outfit is two in one this jacket is gonna go with the matching shorts and it's also gonna go with the jeans that i bought i have this super cute jacket right here it's like a cropped jacket it's honestly so adorable it's not even a joke and then here are the matching shorts i never really knew the purpose of having a jacket and then shorts because it kind of like defeats the purpose like is it hot or cold you know but then i bought these really big jeans and i'm gonna have to find some type of way to like figure it out because I'm so short that they go so much past they go so past my dang feet it's crazy like I would honestly trip and hurt myself you guys see what I'm saying like this is so cute do y'all see how the jacket is like shaped like it has like the wings underneath it it's perfect perfectly cropped the shorts are so perfect because they're not like booty shorts like they're like really long like Bermuda type of shorts or whatever you call them super adorable outfit I love the colors I just love it all this is my kind of outfit for sure it looks like me it's super like basic but it's really cute this is the kind of outfit that I would definitely run morning errands in when it's not so hot or just like a day that it's not that hot but lately it's been so hot so this would definitely be like something that I run errands in the morning time so I am aware that this is not really like a summer outfit but you guys know I'd be wearing hot stuff anyway like I'm still gonna wear this stuff this summer I'm still gonna wear it sometimes I'm out late at night and it gets colder let's say I want to go to a bonfire or something you never know and I can just wear this because it does get colder at nighttime so super cute right super baggy cargo jeans like look how much they come past my feet 
like they're so long I'm, I'm really i'm really like a short person for real so like nothing ever really fits me like jeans and stuff like that but super cute right they have two huge pockets on the side they kind of look like my dad's work pants just like a little bit but like look at me here is another one of these outfits. This um, jacket is the same exact jacket that I have on right now, just in a different color. When I bought these shorts, I was not expecting for them to be that short. I thought they were the same exact shorts that I had um, on with this, like the same exact length as the ones that I had on with this jacket. No, they're definitely way shorter. But they're not too bad. So I'm gonna go ahead and try on this outfit for you guys as well, and we'll see how I like that. But I love matching sets because they're always gonna go with something. Very cute, very cute. I just don't know how I feel about the shorts. I don't feel like they come too much past my butt. I just feel like it's really like dangerous like if I were to like bend over like you could totally see like these are the type of shorts that I don't usually go for because they are so short we are getting down to the nitty-gritty baby okay this outfit is super basic I'm not even gonna talk about it that much because I didn't buy these pants yesterday I bought these from a garage but I bought them in that vlog that I was telling you about so they still have these pants super cute but I'm just gonna go ahead and match it up with this super basic t-shirt it's really basic this is not even that cute of an outfit it's really honestly like simple but I got this shirt right here it's like a patchwork type of shirt with my cargo pants I don't even know what they called these for I forgot because I don't have the tag on it but I'm not really sure what they called these but they're like cargo it's like cute pants if you go into a garage you're most likely gonna see this they have like these pants everywhere this is the outfit I really do like it actually it's actually really cute I wore these pants yesterday the colors go together so well what the heck was I talking about I be hating on my own self sometimes <laughs> This is cute. I just honestly just want to like, I be getting stuck sometimes. Sometimes when I think about just how good the Lord is, like I was just sitting here like the mall that I went to, I went to the Novi Mall to go get these things. And I was just thinking like when I was a little girl, there was this girl on my neighborhood, on my block. And like we were in the hood, but some people had money in the hood. So she was one of the people. And so her mom would always take her to go get Abercrombie and Fish, Justice, Hollister, American Eagle. And she would take her out to the Novi Mall. And I remember just wishing and praying and like hoping one day I could go. I remember like really, really wanting to be able to go there and get the clothes that I wanted. And like now I'm here being able to drive myself there. And it just feels like it's honestly like crazy because I remember just like being in that situation where I was just so insecure and upset that I just couldn't go get the nice clothes and I had to wear hand-me-downs or like holy clothes, stained clothes, high water clothes. But I was just thinking about that, just how good the Lord Jesus Christ is. This is a little bit different and I don't really know how to feel about it. I bought another one of those dresses. I totally forgot about this. I bought another one of those dresses, but this jacket is from Zara. I got it in Miami and I spent good money on it. How much did I spend on it? I spent $70 on this jacket in Miami. And then I bought this dress yesterday from Garage. Super cute. What is this jacket even called? I don't even, they didn't even really name it, so you can't even really look it up on their website. I seriously must not be a dress girl because I cannot really stand these dresses right now. Like, I'm just not the biggest fan of them. This is such a cute jacket. I love it so much. But I'm just not like a dress girl at all because I'm just not really feeling these dresses like at all. I don't know about y'all, but I was not the best kid in eighth grade. Like, after my dad passed away, I switched schools and I went to this hood school and it was just like bad as crap. I was bad. And so, us girls, like, we was just ratchet and bad. We would get dressed up sometimes and we would wear our dresses. And so, when we wore our dresses, girl, we was popping. Like, everybody be like, oh, Oh my gosh like y'all wearing dresses this and this and that and so i wore a lot of dresses like this like i wasn't really wearing loose dresses i was wearing like the tighter dresses so we'd be up in there like yeah 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 you know and i kind of feel like this is bringing back those days like those memories of me wearing dresses and like i don't know girl i'm not really feeling these dresses right now but um my camera's about to die i'm about to put y'all on the charger and i'll be back in like an hour okay you guys so i am back and we are getting down to our last outfit i have a black um you know that blue here it is this blue shirt that i was showing you guys with those jeans i have a black one and i'm gonna match it up with these really cute cargo type of pants pants are so cute obviously from garage they have like these buckles on the side with like pockets and everything they're so adorable you guys have to see what they look like on i have the khaki pair and those are also really cute straight up you can never go wrong with an all black outfit i love all black outfits they always look amazing the only thing that i do not really like is like if you're getting like lint on your clothing it's gonna show up 100 so i always have to have like a lint roller with me and if i don't i'll be like tripping the whole entire time i have that outfit on because when you're inside the outfit's cute then when you get outside the sun makes it so that you can see everything so when I get out on the sun, I can see everything that's on my clothing and girl black clothing holds a lot of length all clothing does it's just that black clothing you can see it for real but these pants are high enough to where they can go all the way up and nothing will be cropped i'm just letting them down a little bit because it wouldn't really look right and this right here is what the outfit looks like in the mirror i know i didn't really show you guys every single outfit in the mirror but i feel like some of them just needed to be shown in the mirror and this is the kind of outfit where it is all black so it's not very easy to see on camera so i'm hoping that you guys can see like a little bit more detail while i'm in the mirror so like i just said you can never go wrong with an all black outfit here's an all black outfit right here i don't know really how i feel about it because i don't know how I feel about the shirt because it is a little bit like too cropped but basically it's not like a black black it's kind of like a washed up black like 
a dingy black. Like if you were to wash black jeans over and over and over again, they're gonna kind of get like that grayish look to them. And this is kind of like what that look is. I'm gonna go ahead and try it on for you guys. But I basically have this black collared shirt and I got it in a size medium because I did not want it. Yeah, I got it in a size medium because I did not want it to be too cropped and it's still super cropped. So I can only imagine the extra small or the small. And then I got these jeans, which are honestly super adorable. I never really go for jeans that have this look to them only because I had a pair, I had black jeans growing up and we couldn't afford to get new clothes. So we wore the same, I wore the same black jeans over and over again. And so they looked so dingy and old that they're going for the look now, but I had to struggle through that look. Okay, so it's definitely a cute outfit. I do like the outfit. I think it's kind of like, okay, it's not really my style. I think it's like, I may be wrong because I don't keep up with everybody, but it kind of looks like something like Kendall Jenner would wear, you know? Like I think I've seen her wear something kind of like this, like the collared crop top. I think hers was more cropped. Like now that I look at it, that's kind of like the vibe that I'm getting, but like this shirt is just not really all the way me. I love the rip and the jeans. I think that like honestly like makes the jeans. And this outfit would actually go cute with these shoes right here. Straight up it would. Up and down it would. This is like that kind of outfit. And like my hair has to be done a certain kind of way for this outfit because this is not really like my kind of style. So I'd have to like put a for real twist on it. So I'm not the biggest fan of this outfit. Okay, so this next outfit, I have this New York shirt. I got it in a size medium because I didn't want it to be too cropped because last time I bought this shirt, I believe I got it in an extra small. Um, I think I got the blue one and like a black or navy blue one. They were way too cropped. So I went ahead and picked up a medium and then I got these gray shorts, these Bermuda shirts to go ahead and go with them because these are like my favorite shorts. Like honestly, like seriously. This is annoying as crap. I don't think I'm gonna be able to wear this. I might have to return this shirt for real or just like give it to my niece or something because it's that small. For some reason, I kind of really am obsessed with this outfit because it's just so basic and it's just like, I'm not even trying to get dressed up, but it still looks cute. And I'm also just loving how it's not as cropped as those other shirts. Oh my gosh, this is a really cute outfit. Very, very, very cute. I can pull this off any day for the summertime. It's just like really adorable. Like I honestly love this style. This is like the college girl style, college summertime girl style. Going to Starbucks, going to Target really quickly, running a few errands, maybe go to the beach, maybe go out with some friends for dinner, for acai bowls or whatever they call them. And I love this outfit, baby. But this next outfit, girl, is honestly really basic. These shorts are not even from Garage. I had to find, um, some type of shorts that will go with this black and white shirt. It's another patchwork shirt. And I'm gonna go ahead and match them up with my H&M shorts. I got these from H&M. These are also Bermuda shorts, but they're like the jean Bermuda shorts. So I went ahead and put these together and let's go ahead and see what they look like. Okay, so here's the outfit. And I bought this really ugly belt yesterday. It's not ugly, but it definitely does not go with this outfit. I think I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. I don't really like the style and like the little twist that it's putting on my outfit. Not my style at all. Y'all remember these? These used to be so popular. Get your Aeropostale or American Eagle jeans and your Aero shirt and then you put those on girl this is the outfit i just don't feel like there's much to say about the outfit it's really basic and i don't think i'm ever gonna honestly like wear these two together when i was shopping i wasn't looking for pieces to go to, to go together i am really good at just buying a bunch of pieces and then trying to put them together and then later on once i've worn those pieces together i'll just match them up with other pieces that i already have all of our outfits are gone but i wanted to go ahead and show you guys the last little material things that i have so I have this super cute hoodie. This is super cute, it has like the tennis stuff on it. It's just like a really big hoodie. I can kind of show you guys what it looks like on. Okay, so this is what this looks like. It's like a really cute, like nice hoodie or whatever. I also have some white shorts that I didn't show you guys. I had these white Bermuda shorts that are also really cute that I can just go ahead and put over here. But like, you know, it's like a really like basic outfit that I could wear with like my Vans or whatever. But I had bought like these socks to go with it and they're not cute at all. They're really cheaply made. So like they kind of like look see-through when you put them on. They just look really bad, but I thought that those would be really cute and they're actually not. So this would be like an outfit, like, like once again, if I'm going skateboarding or if it's like late at night and it's like a little bit colder outside, I could totally wear something like that. But right now, no. I do need to show you guys these pants. They had these pants in a size extra small. What do they even call these pants? The Pantalon Wide Leg Pleated Pant. I got these in a size extra small, the smallest size that they had. And they are huge. They're so big, I'll never be able to wear them. So I think when I go out, when I go out of town again, I'll have to go ahead and return these because she was telling me like 30 day return policy. But after that, you could just go ahead and like exchange something. So I might just exchange it. Um, and then make sure that you make an account. It's really smart to make an account with places like Target, places like Garage, H&M, because you're always gonna have your receipts when they scan your loyalty thing. So even if you don't have that paper receipt, you'll always have your receipt either in your email or in, on the app. Places like Victoria's Secret, Bath and Body Works, they will email you in journeys, they'll email your, your receipt so you'll always have it. But anyway, these pants are super big. They're so big that I actually might have to wear a pair of pants underneath it because these are actually making the pants not look as big around my waist. They fall all the way down when there's no pants underneath them so I might have to wear another pair, pair of pants underneath these but look how big they are they're cute though and the thing is I could totally wear this together I just got to figure out what kind of shirt I would put underneath this outfit but I feel like I could totally rock this and it would be like so cute and like 
really just like a statement honestly like I can totally wear this okay so over here on this table I picked up a bra and underwear set the other day also from garage so I bought the Calvin Klein underwear and then I bought the um, bras I do have to say that their bras run small so I bought a size medium which usually I would be in a small but I bought a size medium in the bra because they run small and they're also gonna shrink and then I bought this I'm not even I'm not even gonna try it on because it's so cropped um actually I guess I can show you guys okay so I definitely cannot stay in this shirt way too cropped not even cute i mean it would be cute if it was longer so i mean nice and everything it just says paradise beach club but i most likely won't really be wearing that out in public and then i have this top which was also way too cropped so i'm most likely just gonna wear this as like um, a pajama shirt or like a bra underneath my shirt they're just way too cropped and i think this material is nice enough to be able to use as a bra um i also bought like this bucket hat which i thought was also super cute like this is it's cute and then last but not least, I bought another pair of socks. They just have like a peach on them. And these were like a similar color to the Miami shirt and then the, the orange bottoms from H&M. Similar color, so I went ahead and picked those up just in case I wanted to wear those. But that is everything that I'm going to be sharing with you guys in today's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I really, really, really do. I enjoyed film filming it. I had a very amazing time. I have been seriously getting into clothing. And so I have been holding back from shopping just to be able to go shopping in a big trip and show you guys everything that I got. But I just love buying new clothing, trying new clothing, trying different things. I go through different phases so like certain things will just make me super joyful and happy in the moment and like clothing is doing that for me at the moment so hey hey not gonna hold you guys any longer though definitely go ahead and treat yourself for the summer get some nice clothes that you're gonna feel confident in H&M is honestly an amazing place to go and they have super cheap clothing with super good quality anyway with that being said your girl's gonna go ahead and head up out of here god bless you all in the mighty powerful name of the lord jesus christ if you guys want me to go to H&M and do like a whole new summer wardrobe with H&M which would be a little bit cheaper let me know anyway with that being said it's time for you to go ahead and head up out of here